So I grew these vegetables in my garden. It's called a loofah and you can use it as a shower sponge. Let me show you how I grew them. I would consider this a rare plant, so you'll only find the seeds really online. This plant wants warm weather, but it takes 6 to 7 months for the plant to establish its fruit. The first time I grew this, I planted it in summer, and by the time it started flowering and fruiting, it was already winter and I never got fully grown loofers. So unless you live in an area that has consistent warm weather for more than 6 months, you're probably going to want to plant them in spring, and because it can be cold in spring, I put mine in a greenhouse to ensure germination. Because loofers don't like being transplanted, ideally you'd want to sow the seeds on the spot that you intend to grow the plant, but because I needed to grow it in the greenhouse first, the container was my best option. When you transplant, it takes some time for the plant to establish itself, but once it does, it grows so fast. You'll start seeing male and female flowers popping out everywhere. This plant wants a lot of space to grow, and here I am just giving it that extra support that it will need to grow vertically. At one point it even grew into the roof, and I could have managed it better, but I just let the plant do its own thing. If you want yours to grow more horizontal than vertical, you can do that. With regards to pests, you may have a problem with pumpkin fly the moment fruit starts forming. If you do, cover your fruit with either newspaper or a breathable fabric. It's really amazing how such large vegetables and foliage can grow from such a thin stem. At this point you could harvest the loofers while they're green and you could eat them, they are edible. But if you allow them to dry, you could get a much cooler utility out of them. I only grew two large loofers because I didn't follow my own advice about the pumpkin fly. It's actually a really satisfying feeling to peel your own loofah. I got so much seeds from these two loofers and I'd like to share with those watching. So if you watch till the end of the video, I'll explain how you can get of these seeds. Now you just need to get out all the seeds, give them a rinse and they are good to be used. You could use them to wash your body. You could even use them in the kitchen to wash your plates and glasses. I've even seen videos on TikTok where people have made slippers from this loofah because of its sponginess. So you'd probably be asking how long can you use it for, how long does it last? And this piece here, my wife and I have been using for five weeks now. This is a piece that hasn't been used. There's not much difference, but I can tell from the feeling and just by looking, having a closer look, you might not be able to see on the camera, the fibers are starting to like unravel. Once it does become like unuseful you can just compost it these loofers sell for quite a lot on uh, online stores take a lot i saw it was selling for 150 rand for about a piece like this 10 centimeters so yeah it's definitely worth growing so you want to grow your own loofer or you want to start gardening in general i would like to invite you to our upcoming seed swap the 27th of may in grossi park there will be a seed swap and plant swap if you have plants that you'd like to share seeds that you'd like to share even if you don't have any seeds, please come. We want to share with you our seeds. We want to build a community of people that are interested in sustainable living, in gardening. Anyone who's into nature, you should come. One of my videos that went viral about rabbit farming, Obedul will be there. You'll be his rabbits. You can ask him questions on how to get into rabbit farming. We have Nazir, who you've seen on this page before, talking about Korean natural farming and other ways of composting and fertilizing your plants without having to spend any money. I have another friend, Salih, who's into growing a certain plant that I can't mention here on TikTok, and he will teach us how to grow it and use it medicinally in a halal way. So I hope you look forward to that. Guys, I hope to see you there.